Hello and welcome to The Man Games. We are doing another how to create video and it is Seth Rollins from SummerSlam. Now first of all I have an apology to give out just because um, earlier on this week we had um, a couple of videos go up and because I've recorded a few videos all together just to save um, time because obviously I work five days a week for like mostly four days so I only get to do this in my spare time. And yeah, I realized the microphone wasn't plugged in. It was next to the laptop, but it wasn't plugged in. So if the sound and audio and stuff hasn't been as good as it normally is, it's um, yeah, all my fault because, and I forgot to put my phone on sound as well. So my phone's just gone off as well. So that's a great start. Um, so yeah, sorry, the, the microphone was next to the laptop, just not plugged in. So if there was any audio issues or sounding issues, that's totally my fault. So yeah, we're going to be looking at how to create this version of Seth Rollins from SummerSlam where he got defeated by Edge by submission, which is quite surprising, um, really that it was by submission. Um, you know what, I'm just going to turn my phone on to silent before we go into the video because I don't want this to keep on happening. Right then, so before we go into the how to create part of the video though, if you are a new watcher to the man games, um, well I hope you're not actually because this wasn't a great start was it? Um, but if you are and you stuck with us, thank you very much, please think about subscribing to the channel, it's a great way to help support the man games and if you do enjoy the video please remember to click that like button and let me know what you thought of Seth Rollins tapping out at SummerSlam in the comments. Right then, so we're going to go into the in-ring attire first. And we're going to go to upper body, we're going to go down to the lower left arm and it is that wrist tape or wristband or sweatband, whatever you want to call it there. Matte is the material and the colour is black. And then we're going to go across to the right hand. So and um, this is the um, the the bandage or the tape or whatever they put around the hands and the material is default and the colour is white and now we're going to go down to the lower part so obviously you can see um, we've got these tights here so we'll click on them and ones there material we have rubber rubber and rubber and colours we have black that shade of gold there so if you look at the color picker that will give you the correct shade of gold and black again and now into images this is where the fun part happens so we'll click on this rectangular image first so you can see that part flash in there so that is covering up the original um, part of the tights so the material is default and the color is black for that one and now this next one here, click on that, so you can see that part flashing there, and the colour for that will be black as well, and now across again, that one there, material again is default, and that is for that part there, obviously you can see it flashing, so the colour for that again is black, and across again, so now we've got this one, and that is for that part there and it is black again the material is default again and now we have these images here that is for the belt as you can see there going around there them two images there now we've got um, this image here so we'll click on that and that is for the center part there as you can see it flashing the same again the material is default and the color is black a bit more of the belt there and then we've got these lines here these lines are for the um, like the what do you call them the thing your, your belt goes in um, yeah don't know what you call them so yeah great this video is going great isn't it and um, so yeah they want to be black so you've got one two three four five of them they're going round so they're all exactly the same so you can see if we go around there where they want to be so that just saves a bit of time there because these images perhaps do take a bit of time so and then look you've got that part there that is same again the material wants to be default and the colour is black again now to this one and 
and there we go that is for the crotch part and that looks to be black again and now to this next one so that is for the knee part there same again default and black for the colors and now we've got this one here and that is for that part there same again, the colour wants to be black, the material wants to be default, and now we're on to another one. That part there, same again, default and black. That one there. And that is for the other knee part, you can't really see it, but you know, it's worth still doing. Default and black again for that part. And now this one here. So that is for that part there. Same again, default and black. So then you should be left with it looking like that. And then we're going to go down to the knees. So the knee pads. So it's them ones there. You've got material rubber and rubber. And colours are black and black. So you've only got the, the knee pad on the right. And you've got them two images there going over it. So it looks like that. And now down to shoes and boots. So it's them boots there, as you can see. Material we have matte, satin, satin and metallic. And the colours are black, white, white, and that shade of gold there. As you can see, that's for the little bit, bits on it there. So that should be it for the in-ring attire. And now we're going to cross to the entrance attire. Edit, clothing, upper body, down to the jacket then. So as you can see, it is this jacket. Here, once it's loaded up, and the material wants to be matte and matte. Right then, colours, so we've got black and black. And now for the images, so we've got that image there, click on that. Material, so that is covering quite a, a big patch there, which is obviously what you want because it saves a lot of time. Default for the material and the colour is black. Then you've got that image um, there, so we'll click on that. So that image there is going on that part of the jacket as you can see there, so that's where it wants to be. Then we have this image here, so we'll click on that to show you, apply again. And that is for the other side. So it looks like that. And then finally we've got them two images there and they're for the arms or the lowers of the arms should we say so you can see them there and there and that is it i do believe that is how to create seth rollins from summerslam 2021 well i hope you did enjoy this video and find it helpful if you did so please remember to click that like button and let me know in the comments what you thought of the video and what you think is next for rollins and edge so, um, Extreme Rules is coming up, with it being like a submission finish, it could be an I Quit match maybe, that could be a, a match they have. Um, it wouldn't surprise me if they do something just like a steel cage though, just because they want to chuck a stipulation in there, that wouldn't surprise me at all, um, to be honest. But yeah, we'll just have to see um, going forward what they do. Um, so like I said before, please if you did enjoy the video, click the like button, let me know in the comments what you thought and also if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, and there's a video then, it's a great way to help support the man game. So thank you very much for watching this video today and I'll see you on the next video.